Engine failure identification. V1, rotate. Engine failure. Positive rate. Gear up. Autopilot A command, identify the failure. Engine flame out, there is no apparent damage or airframe vibration. The engine spools down normally and some rotation can be observed on N1 and N2. Memory action is not required. Engine severe damage, typical indications are the lack of rotation of the N1 or N2, or both. The instrument will indicate zero. A condition such as this would regularly be accompanied by noise, bang, or vibration. Memory action is required. Engine separation, this is recognizable by the loss of signal to the engine instrumentation. N1, N2, and engine vibration will indicate zero, while fuel flow, oil pressure, oil temperature indications will be blank. This malfunction can be accompanied by noise, bang, or vibration. The engine fire detection fault light will be illuminated. The associated hydraulic system will be lost. Memory action is required. Engine turbine blade failure, this indication is typical of an engine turbine blade detaching from the turbine. Effects can include loud bang, high or rapidly rising EGT, high vibration at high thrust setting, decrease in N1 efficiency, and or decrease in available thrust. Attention, the high EGT and the loud bang can also be an indication of an engine surge or stall. If the crew cannot positively confirm that the engine has a severe damage, it may be more convenient to follow the memory actions from the engine limit, surge or stall checklist. In this case, the thrust lever of the affected engine will be retarded, and this action may clear the stall. If with the thrust lever in idle, the engine indications are still abnormal, the crew may consider following the severe damage memory actions. Some of the reasons for engine stalls are bird ingestions, internal engine failures, and pneumatic bleed malfunctions. Remember, no matter how loud is the bang, airplane control is always the first priority. In some situations, the engine may recover with no crew action, but in some others, crew action will be necessary. In case the stall is caused by some internal damage, probably it will not be possible to recover the engine. In this case, a shutdown may be the logical choice depending on the operational situation. For more information about engine stalls, watch the engine stall video available on this channel. Thank you for watching.